This is Ewok, and well, I've been reading the comments on my screen packs tutorial for the past few weeks, and well, seems like pretty much no one can figure it out. Look, the video was added a long time ago, about the time I started playing Mugen. I figured it out by myself with some help, but still, it's simple enough to figure it out. As you can see, on my computer screen, I'm on a website. Most of you may recognize it already, but let me zoom into the web address for some of you. Look closely. unofficial winmugenjpnorg This is the website to download Mugen. I'm pretty sure most of you know that already, but I'm showing anyone who doesn't. So look, there are two links. No Limit when Mugen Patch and no limit when you mean patch fix. Click on the top link. Not so look, I already downloaded Mugen, so I can show you. See? Right here is my Mugen right here. It's in a .rar file right now, but that doesn't really matter, so I'm gonna extract it for you guys. Now look, Basically, you can download Mugen and extract it with whatever file service you use, like WinZip, WinRAR, PZip. I don't really care. I find WinRAR a lot easier to use. So click Extract and extract it to your desktop, alright? And so, now, let, now, Mugen is on my computer right now. See? Right there. Mugen. Now, right above Mugen you'll see I have a screen pack. It's called Shoryuken. You can download it off the website, go to MugenFury.com, go to Screen Packs, and look for Shoryuken. It's a little tricky to navigate, but I have no problem finding the screen pack. So, right now I'm going to extract it for you and show you step by step how to add a screen pack, okay? Like most screen packs, it comes with a couple of files and a folder. So most come with folders. But look, the necessary files that you need to make this work. Fight.sff, fight.snd, select.dev, system.dev, system.sff, system.snd. These are all very crucial files. Without them, Eugene wouldn't freaking work, okay? So look, extract these to your desktop or wherever you can easily find it. Now, I'm going to show you how to add it, alright? Let's go into Mugen and go into the data folder. Oh, sorry. Data folder. Now look. As you can see, there's, if you haven't tampered with it already, it should look something like this. The file is untouched or anything, alright? So, get all the fight files, the select file, the system files, get them all together. Drag them into your data folder. Set, click yes to all to replace all the files. And as simple as that, that is how you add a screen pack, okay? Now some of you may be thinking that, of course, when you add a screen pack, all of your characters and stages are removed. This happens every time you add a screen pack, okay? It's not like you, it's not like I broke your Mugen on purpose, so don't comment that I broke your Mugen, because I didn't. Obviously, you might have not followed the instructions enough. You didn't follow the instructions closely, okay? Okay, yeah. Go into your select file, and look. Most select files will look like this for the characters. You'll see either blanks, random selects, or if the author took the time to organize it carefully, it'll have something like put character here, don't remove this. But this one is very simple. All it has is blanks. Right now, you just highlight the text for the first slot. Type in the character's file name. You have to make sure that the character's folder and the character's .def file are the same. Next, You'll also be seeing this section called Extra Stages. 
this is where you add all of your stages. This is already pre-added. The Kung Fu Man stage is already pre-added. Now, I don't have any of these stages, so let's get rid of that. Always make sure in the stages, in the stages section, there's a space left. If there isn't a space left, right there, if there's no space, it's not going to work. I don't understand why it won't work without that space, but it's very important. That's pretty much all there is to it. Now, some stage, some screen packs also come with other folders, like this font folder here. Some also come with sound folders. And if the author really took the time, most screen packs would be already organized in folders to make it easier for all of you. Let's just add this font folder real quick. And I'll show you. Look, Mugen is working, okay? If your new screen pack isn't applied, I swear I went through every step there is. I went through every step. I didn't tamper with it in any way. So please, don't comment saying that I broke it, okay? Because I didn't. I took the time out of my night to record a new one for you.